Hello, Mr. Mike. Hello, sir. Hello, Engineer Mike. I can hear you.
Thank you, Pastor. Life and presence.
control strategies and economic impact of poultry disease in commercial and rural poultry and indigenous knowledge on rural poultry health. His research has a translational impact and of the benefits to humanity. For instance, in collaboration with others, he has decided on developing complementary products for treatment of elithiasis and snake envenomation, producing a pelleted thermostable new to disease vaccine and suitable grains for use as vegetables for mass vaccination of rural country against new past disease. Furthermore, he participated in the development of a simple, very cheap and rapid acid for mild disease diagnosis. I present Professor Abdul for the President. Um, the next question is not actually for introduction. So I call on Professor Faro J. again to read the citation of uh, Professor Rasim and the Adrian. Professor Vasil Lare Adeyemo, a professor of oral and maxillofacial surgery at the College of Nursing University of Lagos, fellow of the National Postgraduate Clinical College of Nigeria, fellow of the West Africa College of Surgeons and International College of Surgeons, foundation fellow of Academy of Nursing Specialties of Nigeria, and fellow of the Nigerian Academy of Nursing. His research focus is on gene environment interaction in the etiology of artificial clefts. Professor Adeyemo has won awards and distinctions in the University of Lagos as best researcher, best researcher award also in 2009, and also the best researcher award in the Faculty of Dental Sciences. 2011, 2012, and 2014. He was adjudged the most cited researcher in the University of Lagos and 13th in Nigeria by the Governmental Grant. <laughs> he was, his works have been cited 5,787 times and also with an age index of 43. He was awarded the 2018 Gold Medal Prize in Life Science 
And this is the body in Nigeria, Academy of Science, for its significant scientific achievements in using the cutting edge and expertise of molecular genetics to understand the basis of the environmental etiology of cleft lip parts and craniofacial defects in sub Saharan Africa. His team also has won many research grants worth more than $8 million. Professor AMO has presented his research works in more than 120 national and international conferences and has published over 220 academic papers. He was the first subject of the Faculty of Dental Sciences in the College of Medicine University of Lagos. He is currently the Chairman of the Medical Advisory Committee, Lagos State University Teaching Hospital. I present Professor Adeyemo. The next person to be inducted is Professor Amy Davidson, Father of the So, I have Professor Titan, Professor Father of the Union. Thank you. Professor Henry Yetisi, Father of the Union. Henry Fernando is a professor of entomology and best management at Texas A and M University College Station, Texas United States of America. He also serves as associate director and chief scientific officer of Texas A and M Agri Lab Research and as associate dean for research for the College of Agriculture and Life Science. Professor Father Moro received his bachelor's degree in first class in 1989 and master's degree in 1992 in biology from the Virtual University of Technology at Korea, Nigeria. In 1992, he was awarded a Rose Scholarship to study at Oxford University, UK, where he received a PhD degree in zoology. has received over 20 million dollars in research grants and published 120 scientific public publications and several other articles. His publications have been cited widely with over 3,830 citations 
and an age index of 36. And his research has resulted in patents and innovation. His groundbreaking research in chemical, physiological mechanism of plant insects and tritrophic interactions have impacted pest management programs across the globe and is a member of the National Academy of Inventors in the United States. <laughs> he has mentored 40 worldwide students and scores of African scholars, including 18 Nigerians. Professor Farah's academic accomplishment at the recognized global the various awards and prizes. He was named Fellow of the Royal Entomological Society in 2010 and elected Fellow of the African Academy of Sciences in the year 2021, a distinguished higher education administrator. Professor Father Nero has made a strong ties with institutions in Nigeria and has established endowment funds of academic excellence at Nigeria University. He has been recognized for his significant contributions to the advancement of the science and human capacity development in Africa. I present to Professor Father Nero for. Please, this is a solemn assembly. May I implore the photographers to please be very, very careful not to miss this. I present Professor Adishan Walai Wala Fatusi for induction as a fellow of the Nigerian Academy of Science. Professor Adishan Fatusi is currently the Vice Chancellor of the University of Medical Sciences in Ondo State. Professor Adishan Fatusi has been a lead researcher an actor in the adolescent action in Nigeria since the 1990s. He played a lead role in the development of Nigeria's first national and productive health agenda as a technical advisor to the United Nations Population Fund, supported operationalizing sustainable reproductive health in Nigeria projects in 1999. And he remains a frontline reproductive health expert. He has published 102 articles in peer reviewed journals, 
and contributed 11 book chapters with 10,821 citations and an age index of 36 and an item index of 75. He has been the principal investigator and co principal investigator of 26 externally funded projects, totaling over 4 million US dollars and over 281 print that greater printing pounds. He also led the development of the adolescent health components for the 2014 proposal to the global form of the $2 million, as well as 2017 proposal on AIDS, tuberculosis, malaria, and health system strengthening of about 346 million US dollars. He has successfully supervised the 16 the fellowship, two PhD and 30 MPH and MSc candidates. Recognized as a global expert in adolescent health, he serves on several key global and regional agenda setting bodies, including the Lancet Commission on Adolescent Health. He is the only African based scholar on the commission. And Yeah, I a lot of committee group of adolescent and has led development of Titan National. I 
as producing sites, after the family events, insecticides, antifidant, psychotoxic, and anti-cancer events, and has evaluated other additional products of biological activities. Professor Dubois has supervised 18 MSc, 10 PhD students, and one fellowship candidate for the postgraduate medical college of Denver's country. To date, while the PhD students are ongoing, she has 79 published articles and 47 abstracts and posters recorded in our impact journals to her credit. She is the first Nigerian senior professor in pharmacopoeia and won the University of Lagos Gold Medal Honor for Excellence in Research and Innovation. She has served as dean of the Faculty of Pharmacy and head of the Department of Pharmacopoeia in the University of Lagos. She pioneered the first Nigerian Alpha Therapeutics Laboratory at the Faculty of Pharmacy University of Lagos and has translated some of our research results into nine products registered with National Agency for Food and Drug Administration Control, NAPDA. <laughs> she is the recipient of the NAPDA Telephone COVID-19 Research Grant Award, Lagos State Research Council Grant Award, and winner of 12 May and Baker Award for Excellence in Pharmacy. She is a fellow of the Pharmaceutical Society of Nigeria, West Africa Postgraduate College of Pharmacy, Nigeria Academy of Pharmacy, and Academy of the Medicine Specialties of Nigeria. I present Hi. Professor Lukemi hereby solemnly promise to promote, declare, and disseminate scientific knowledge and serve the academy according to its statutes and guidance. Prior from Fernand, I hereby formally admit you as a fellow of the Nigeria Academy of Science. Congratulations. The next person to be inducted is Professor Kidia Kidioke of Basili. Professor Gideon Okoko Asili was born in Obi, Anambra State, on the 10th of June 1952. He attended the University of Lagos between 1974 and 1978 on the Federal Government Scholarship and graduated with a BSc in Biology 
second class on a proper edition. After his mandate to National Youth Service in Sokoto, he joined the services for the University of Water Court as graduate assistant in 1979. In 1980, he proceeded to the University of Maryland, a college part of the United States, where he undertook his own graduate studies. He rose through the ranks to become full professor in 1996 in the area of environmental biology and power education. His supervisees have become professors in several Nigerian universities. His research articles include 180 journal articles, 25 conference proceedings, and the hydrocarbon degrading palm wine isolates deposited at the American Type Culture Collection in Rockville, United States. His publications have been cited 3,544 times by authors with an age index of 31. He won the International Foundation for Science and Ethics than three times between 1988. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, that will be the size of our broadcast of uh, the program all the way from Abuja, where you've been watching or listening on our various channels to the induction of fellows and public lecture of the Nigerian Academy of Science uh, being held at the Cadastra Zone AO Central Business District Abuja, venue for the induction ceremony of the Nigerian Academy of Science, where the Vice Chancellor of the University, among other 10 elected inductees, uh, were inducted officially to the Academy of Science. A big congratulations to the Vice Chancellor of the University. Professor Adishel Mufatusi, who will now be officially referred to as a fellow of the Academy of Science, Professor Adishel Mufatusi, FAS, Vice Chancellor of the University of Medical Sciences, Unimed, Ondo. Uh, on this day, uh, Thursday, 18th of May, 2020. Twenty-three has been doctored fellow. Congratulations to him and congratulations to the Unimed family on this greater feat. Uh, listener and viewer, that should be the size of our broadcast for this uh, program. Other programs will continue to run on our radio channel and uh, on our television channels where you can still listen to other programs already slated for the day. And I will say a big thank you to the Center for Health Profession and Biomedical Education and uh, the ICT Department of the University for this uh, wonderful output uh, all the way from Abuja, venue of this induction ceremony. My name is Temitokbe Uluwatayo from the Public Relations Unit of the University. I want to say thank you for staying tuned and enjoy the rest of your day.